season I hate it when summer comes I fall into a trap that I made by myself Oh, and I always do the wrong thing I'm unstable and I'm unsteady I've lost a million times already And I'm so sorry but I'm not able to slow me down I feel unable and so unworthy My heart feels heavy I've lost already and I'm so sorry but I'm not able to slow down now see what I'm seeing. Greetings, my excellent friends, and welcome to the shadow on my face. <laughs> so, here's the deal. I stream in a basement. It's an unfinished basement, as you can tell. Look, I've got my ladder up. I was working on it earlier today. And um, I put in a, um, an amazing light in the other room uh, through the studs here. Let me show you. Oh, look, there's my computer. See, don't, don't look, don't look, don't look. And you can see that light up there is just really amazing. The problem with it is that it's so amazing. <laughs> but I'm, th this is a shadow from the monitor. See the monitor up here? That's where this sits, and then that shadow hits. So I either have to... Oh, look, you can see the shadow from my camera right there. <laughs> um, I may have to block that off before we can continue streaming. I've got a whiteboard here. I wonder if I put the whiteboard there. All right, you guys might have to hear some construction. My wife is probably going to be like, what's going on? That's not a stream. What are you doing down there? Okay, that's not how she sounds, but you know, that's my female voice. <clears throat> oh. Move it over. Pull that mail out. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Not so bad. Pull that mail out. Yeah, we'll guess. Close enough. <gasps> even light oh that is so crooked i am so gonna have to fix that later <laughs> 
All right, let's play some Hogwarts. Welcome to the DIY stream with Shiny Ranger. Man, my my photo, my camera is so small in this game. It's just so tiny and cute. Look at that there over in the corner. <sighs> hmm, that's my camera source. Oh no, not the outro. Sorry. Stick with me, everybody. What did that mean? We're preparing shaders. Anyway, hope everybody's having a good evening. It's so crooked, man. Oh, I'll have to fix it later. Anyway, oh yeah, I've got crazy glasses again. Um. Oh, hey, Deke. What's up, man? <laughs> Little cameo there in the intro. Nice. So I think what we're going to do tonight is maybe try and catch some beasts, work on the Room of Requirement. Do some Merlin trials, that kind of thing. Up. A little bit right there. Make it bigger. Okay, now you can see everything down there. Get my hat, jaunty light, yeah. All right. And off we go. All right, I don't even remember what I was doing. Yet. Oh. Um, I had saved a dragon. I don't think that's in my playthrough. It might be, but I can't remember. Saved a dragon. Um, I've been doing... Oh, I can get some wand handles here. I've been doing things... I, I've just been down here doing Merlin trials, doing um, other things. Get low. This looks like the statue Madam Twiddle mentioned. Oh, this is a battle arena. I don't want to do this right now. I do not want to do it. I, I did a battle arena previously. I'm not, I did not like I mean, I Why did are okay. Why so vases around here? Yeah. Because it's a battle arena. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Marley. Yes, this. Oh. Yeah, there's that. Let's see. We'll pick up some Ashwinder eggs. Rebellion. Okay, so we got that, we got that, and we got that. Can bring up. You know? Um, Bombarda? Bombarda. No. Breezy? Glacius. Yeah. No. I didn't do it. Pendo. Uh. Akio. Wingardium Leviosa. Oh. It looks like little moonstones inside. Huh? Doesn't want me to climb up on him. What am I supposed to do with him? Hmm. Rebellion. Confringer. We're not blowing him up. Huh. Let's see what else we got. We've got an incendio. Try that. Could uh we could depulso it. We could try Leviosa. Ah. 
I don't think we can Crucio it, but we'll try. Oh, that's wrong. Nope. Incendio. Hmm. What the Revelio? More moonstones. Incendio. There's moonstones in there. Bombarda. Activate the statue. Oh no, that's no, can't land on it. I wonder what this uh, challenge is about. Lumos. Repairer. They're moonstones, but I don't know how I would use moonstone. In yeah, that doesn't work here. I transfer and figure the rat. Revelio. Lumos. You guys want some light? Oh, you do want some light. Okay, okay. I think I found it. Okay, that's the first one. Okay, I guess I gotta find more uh, bugs. Wingardium Leviosa. There's some bugs. Lumos. Nice. Okay. You guys with me? Okay. Just because I'm running fast doesn't mean you sl can slack Abandoned off. long ago, no doubt. Ooh, you guys do that. Sweet. Okay. Now we just got to find the last bugs. I came through in the back spot, I guess. No more happy days for you. I was a proud man that day, and there's more of those. <laughs> yes, don't tell us. Two at once. Da da da. Oh. Yeah. Nobody will believe I defeated a Nashwinder by myself. Oh, yeah. I believe it. Because we sneaky. <laughs> Hey, let's look for more, uh, more glowy bugs. Okay. There's the glowy bugs. Maybe there's some over here.
Where are the glowy bugs? It's Revelio. Big glowy bugs. So there were some glowy bugs up here. Okay. Are there any glowy bugs like through the castle that we just had to fight through? Don't see any glowy bugs. That's frustrating. This place has seen better days. Yes, it has. Are we bugs over here somewhere? I feel like I'm very far away at this point. Oh, no, oh, wrong. Well, we do need to go pop these balloons, so. Here's another trial over here, so we're out of the range of that trial. Oh. Mysterious and a bit unsettling. What to do? You're here. Good. Uh, totally not meaning to be here. I'll, I'll talk to you in a minute, bro. Still working this Merlin trial. For real. Oh, I can't do that. This looks intriguing. Where's the third bug? Oh, it can't go in there. All right. The one was here. It's back there behind the castle. Maybe it's over. These rocks have seen better days. Seriously, man. Came through here. Oh. Lumos. Maybe it's up here in this little encampment. Enjoy suffering, do you? Well, you know where I am? I don't think you do. Three at a time. Wambo.
Okay. Well, I cleared out this camp. Let's see if there's any glowy, sparkly bugs. Got some bad guys under me though. Where are the sparkly bugs? Oh, there we go. They are up here. <sighs> Found them. Lumos. forever not forever to figure it out just forever to find the thing all right let's see what else we got. all right we'll go we'll go pop the vases to get it off the quest but I don't know. Last one. Thought over here. Not. Revelio. Hmm. That's it. I should tell Madame Twiddle about what happened. Confringo. Incendio. No, you're not gonna let that burn off. All right. Yeah, we'll go back to her. It's a battle arena. But I solved the quest. I ran across another one on accident, oh, popped all the vases. It opened up, and I'm like, oh, okay. And I did pass that one, but it was... Oh. Mrs. Twiddle, your husband was right. The statue was part of a puzzle. Oh, really? How exciting! Yes, I had to destroy a number of large vases, and that seemed to activate some sort of charm on the statue. Well done! Oh! I miss having someone like you around with a thirst for knowledge and a quick mind. Well, my curiosity has been satisfied. Thank you for that. Who knows what I'll encounter on my next constitutional. Oh, my husband would be so pleased to know he was right about that statue. Rebellion. I should investigate. Yeah, I don't know what you're investigating because... I don't know what's going on. Is that a level 3 lock? We can do level 2 locks, by the way. Got this. Hello, Hamora.
wiggle my top hat. Revelio. Ooh, that's a big one. Ooh, we got some loot to look at. Cool, cool. That is. Bag or something up here. Come on. Oh. Revelio. Oh, this was the dungeon. Right? Oh, wait, no, this was a different place. I don't know what this place is. I uh, ran, I helped somebody in a cellar. They had been breeding spiders and it killed them. I, I don't think that was this place. I think it was a different place. Revelio. Anything on the, uh... In the windmill, maybe? Let's see what we got. All right. Uh, there's a Merlin trial and what? The Mind's Eye? East South Sea Bog? Holy cow. There's, oh my gosh. What? Oh my gosh. There's so much map I hadn't even realized was there. Um... Look at this. Go to the Mer Merlin trial, I suppose. Revelio. Oh, look, more light ones? Yeah, more light ones. I'm so... Oh, look, see, there's some right there. Lumos. Lumos. There you go. Good friend. 
I don't know if there's moths hidden in there, but we'll look at the little dungeon. Revelio. There is a mirror of some sort out there. Go find more lightning bugs. I don't know if these are they. Lumos. Nope, not they. Rodrigo. I do that. Revelio. Oh, this thing. Yeah. Well, that's right. You have to go through it, and then you find a maze. Nice. Human's growth as a wizard, but also his descent into darkness. The hedges he nurtured grew vicious and volatile. Revelio. Okay. Okay, I found my way to another challenge. Revelio. Measle. This is uh, Explorers. This was Accio. Sendo that and some food. Revelio. You cooperate, won't you? I got a girl. I look after you. Need boy. Oh, no, you don't. Got me some measles. Okay. Revelio. I know I'm still working on the, the lights over there, but I think I've got a problem. Think you can petrific as a, a troll? I don't think you can, but probably worth a shot. Ooh. Oh, that's... 
wrong one! Okay, sorry, I wasn't talking. Hmm. Well, there we go. Huh. I don't know what I'm at, but I feel like I just did a good thing getting... Heavy... Oh, it's a medium bandit cap. Well, off we go. Two trolls in it. I think I kind of cheesed to that by pulling him out onto the platform, but you know what? I'm okay with that. <laughs> when the war is over, goblins will ruin And it's up Revenue. there. Up there. Oh, we've got a challenge here to blow those up. What am I doing? What am I doing? I got stuck in a little divot. And then he Radio. almost saw me because of that. Okay. Being able to do hit the troll for an initial hit. It didn't get him, get him. But I was able to get a good hit on him. Your blood's on Ranrock's hands. Oh. Uh. Oh. Here's a pleasant surprise. Oh.
Ravenio. Hmm. Let's do a challenge while we're in the middle of a camp. Yeah, that sounds about right. When they see me, humans do every time. He's like, What's going on? Uh, why don't you come see? Ravenio. You come see what's going on. Clear you out, too. You only have Ranrock to blame. True. Revelio. I think it's cleared. All right, we're clear. Sweet. I didn't mean to clear out that place. Oh, uh, that's in the mine, I bet. And I just wandered over there because, oh, that's what I was looking for right there. Lumos. This Merlin Charles won't get the best of me. I went out looking for that, found something else, and came back and finished it. And we got two Merlin trials done. Alright, let's check our um our uh field guide. All right, challenges. Let's see, combat. 40 dark wizards. Pejo shielding one, okay. Beat dug bogs. Beat goblins. Fury. Infamous foe, Engine wolf mask. Venom. Defeated five trolls. 
did mongrels. Not done the dueling. Th so we've got those. All right. Um, quest. We have any there? Yes. Yeah, six assignments. Off the glass cloak. Hmm. Very nice. Oh, still working on those. Exploration. All the balloons. Oh, and more balloons? Merlin Trials. Increased storage for gear. Okay. Constellations. Oh, we need to do that. Solve a Hogwarts secret. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, we can go do the tables. And we're working on that. Or Trigalia. Islands. Room of requirement. Rescue. Grade your gear. Let's check our map. Let's look for the astronomy tables. Those are easy to do. The the Merlin or the ancient magic hotspots are good too. There's one right there. Go do that one. What's this? A child wandered too far from home? Next time I see Fig or that student. He's likely studied her. Get me out. All right. Let's look at the stars. Let's see. So there's those three. There we go. For Horologium. Nice. Descender. Any who oppose Renrock. Is somebody there? Aha! That's what there you can bring us. <laughs> Still hoping to survive this time! Just one who released Oaks! Glaciers! Confirmed! You've been paying attention! Ah, yeah. Descender! Confirmed! Ah, yeah. Let me be. Oh, hi there, Zoe! Why is he insane? Oh, yes, he gets the zoomies sometimes. Like... Alright, let's see what our challenge Rebellion. is. Uh, something up there. Up here. Confringer. Boom! Here. 
Sneaky one. Yeah. Basically. Stupid. Oh no! <laughs> I just raised with those. They are basically <laughs> like little they're cabbages, they're like grenades. They chomp on bad guys. I've got three challenges, four or five challenges. All right here. Moon calves. Roll lair. Let's go do that moon table. That's what I or star table. What you doing? Had it with your brother. Okay, well that's good. Oh, I've you had it with the dog. I see. The and there's a chip. Oh, this day's gone on too long. That is Buddha. What? Where? Up for a bit of dying, are we? Oh, intruder, and apparently it's not night. Nice. Wingardium Leviosa. Oh, that's levitate. Yeah, it's levitate. Okay, I can't. There's Levioso, which is a difference. Could it be a Merlin trial? There's no talent. I could fall dead asleep on my Brilliant. Who's Can't see me. I'm invisible. He he can kind of see people. Falling, but he can't 100% see me. So I am just being super sneaky, clearing out all the bad guys. Revenio. There's a challenge. I see what the challenge this is a jumping puzzle challenge. Why did I not make it? You have to start over. You have to touch them all without hitting the ground. Oh, I bet it's too far to jump. Oh, no. It's not too far to jump. I failed it by by jumping onto that platform. I thought that was a sneaky way to do it. Nope. 
controls sometimes are very wiggity whack. That's driving me crazy. Oh, I wonder if I can do it from here. Yep, I can. Okay. I was going about it the wrong way. So it's going to stop down to the bottom because the, that one gap is just too far. It's like you grab on. Right, where are we? Well, I came to play with the astronomy table, but I can't. I'll just go do another Merlin cry. Wingardium Leviosa. Oh, I'm going to go. All right. Thanks for coming and watching for a minute. What do you have in store for me this time? Confringo! Revelio! All right, let's do some quests. We've done some side stuff for a bit. Uh, learn Imperio. Have to beat Sebastian by the Overlook or by the Catacomb. I found Zenobi's gob gobstones. I need to find her now. Poached egg. Talk to Poppy and Han. Alright, let's do this one. Uh, no. Let's go talk to Whitson's Bucket. Yeah. We'll go learn all the unforgivable curses. From our Slytherin friend Sebastian. Wonder if I'm safe to explore in there. How nice to see you, my young friend. You're here. Good. Sebastian, that relic you mentioned. I believe one of Slytherin's students stumbled upon the relic during an assignment to study sarcophagi in this catacomb. From what I read in a report by the student, they weren't permitted to take it with them. So I must assume it's still here. As I mentioned earlier, this relic grants its holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. Wow. If it's in this catacomb, I have to find it. For Anne. I need to see her. I'd be interested to know what else the student discovered. Have a look. Unfortunately, there's no name on it. But I suspect if it was important enough for Slytherin to stash in his spellbook, it's worthy of further study. That's interesting. I'm ready to explore the catacomb. Perhaps we can visit Anne when we finished. Perfect. By the way, Ominous has been asking about you. You didn't tell him what we were doing, did you? I didn't. I promise. Good. 
Ominous would be livid if he knew what we were about to do. Yeah, I'm kind of walking that line, right? Lady Kuma's time yielded more than I'd imagined. Learning about our ancestors was illuminating. However, I stumbled upon something else I could not ignore. An area behind the great room which had suffered decay, amid the turned-over sarcophagi, I discovered an oddly shaped relic. Immediately, I sensed its power. I would be thrilled to study the relic further if only the removal of objects were allowed. Ah. I'll be interested to compare what lies inside to what I've read about this catacomb. Okay, I got lots of chomping cabbages. I got I'm sure that foul stuff. smell is the scent of success. Try not to your nerve just yet. Yeah, right. Dead bodies. Uh, that means we need. <laughs> Spiders aren't insects. Don't start. Revelio. <laughs> Accio. We're here for a reason. I'd say opening them all is justified. Revelio. <sighs> Alright, that's probably comes around. Expelliarmus. This room is taller than it looks. Accio. <laughs> Sleep at here. Revelio. Let me get my spot of things on here. Anything else in this room? Akio. Confrigo. Revelio. Not what I wanted. I did not want to confrigo. We have not yet even begun to spider yet, buddy. Now this is the sort of great room I want to be buried in. Me, Surrounded by grandeur. Let me grandeur tell you about spiders. Even an altar with a pile of bones. Uh, Lovely. Bones outside a sarcophagus. Seems odd. There's something here by the altar. Revelio. Foolishly mentioned the relic in my report, and I was reminded to leave it where it lay. But research must come before my fealty to the rules. I sense something about this relic. I was told by those chosen by English Oak Wands for powerful intu intuition. I believe it. Therefore, when no one was looking, I acted. I conjured two barricades to isolate the relic. Ancestors forgive me, but I use their very bones as the key. I plan to return it, but first I must ready myself for our next assignment: learning the imperious curse. The spell is said to serve well against it. What did you find? Rebellion. Bombarder. Arrest of momentum. Akio. Expel the office. Looks like part of a student's diary. It mentions plans to return for the relic and conjuring barricades using bones. Of course. The student's summary referenced the space beyond the Great Room, which means this can't be a dead end. Let's divide and conquer. You work on sorting out the bone barricades. I'll look around and see what we missed. 
Hold on to that diary entry. There may be more to it. It does mention something else. It says their next assignment was learning the Imperius curse. Really? Interesting. We need to focus on moving beyond this room. But let me think for a moment. Do you think the pages were left here on purpose? Slytherin mentioned a student who excelled in charms and always carried a satchel stuffed full of notes. They might have been left on purpose, or the student may have simply dropped them. Hmm. Of course. I'll start to search for those barricades. Brilliant. I've got the goofiest glasses on, man. There's more to this than even I imagined. Revelio. Look, bones stacked oddly on either side of this archway. Hmm. Leave no stone unturned. Or in this case, no bones. Confringo! We've made it this far, but clearly we have more to do. Hmm. Revelio! I forget what this was. Lumos. Oh no, this is a force bridge. That's right. We need to find a safe way across. Accio! Lumos! This must be the way forward. But we need to go back. <laughs> Revelio. Lumos. Andrade Leviosa. Sounds come with the territory. Rebellio. Accio. Looting the entire place. Wingardium Leviosa. You've done it. Hey, yeah. I knew we'd get through. I felt it in my bones. Oh, nice. Okay, so that's the way forward. I feel like this is optional. Let's see what we got in here. I thought this was the way forward. It did not appear to be. Rebellion. We got him, Leviosa. Accio. Lumos. Good friend. Lumos. Accio. Accio. Wingardium Leviosa. Accio. 
Rickety Bone Bridge complete. Accio. Revelio. ourselves in some kind of chamber of loot. Let me have to in the chamber of loot. Of course they're full. Why wouldn't they be full? I forgot to go sell everything before I went dungeon diving. We can sell a bunch of, or we can destroy a bunch of green stuff. That's fine. We'll just keep blue or better. We've got a lot of gold right now. And I think we have most of everything we want. Revelio. Okay, so that came up here. Fun. Get that gold. You can take gold. All right, this is the way forward. Before we trudge on further, I just realized something. The student's diary mentions the Imperious Curse. I wouldn't be surprised if we're going to need it here. It's an unforgivable, but useful when you're outnumbered places the victim completely under the caster's control. So, if you'd like to learn Imperio, I can teach you. Where did you learn the Imperio's curse? I taught myself. Don't tell Ominous that I've told you. It's not exactly something I can brag about, but it may come in handy. I think you ought to know it. Shouldn't I know more about what the curse entails? Remember the blasting curse? Same idea, except when it comes to unforgivable curses, your intention has to be clear. You have to mean it. Oh, wow. It's probably wise to know the spell. I couldn't agree more. A spell that could save your life shouldn't be unforgivable. You have a lot at stake. You have an ability that evidently no one's seen for centuries. Maybe I shouldn't have learned these unforgivables. Focus your wand movement. It's not an easy spell to master. Ooh, wow. There we go. Something troubling ahead. Be on your guard. I'm not gonna use it. Rebellion! Confringo! Arrest the momentum! Bombarda! Accio! Revelio. Accio. Confringo. Revelio. Confringo.
mess. Oh, yeah. Bit dramatic, isn't it? Rebellion. Kunbringo. Accio. Incendio. Pull on Wigan Welds. You need some Wigan Welds? Rebellion. You need some healing potions. Bombarda. There are so many holes in this place. I do not know where to go. Rebellion. This catacomb has suffered decay. Just as the student summary described. I doubt anyone's been here in quite some time. Go this way. Bombarda. Revelio. All right, this is the way through. Another barricade. Consider it on the last one. This should be a cinch. <laughs> How gracious of you. Oh, I, I see. It's a pattern. Okay, hold up. Let's see here. We got Tetris piece, crop circle. So if we go Tetris piece, yeah. crop circle. That worked. Keep going. Okay, and then we go uh, Celtic knot, swirly faces. Just empty. And let's pull those out of there while we got a chance. No wrong. We go. And then Celtic knot uh, crop circle. Celtic knot. Oh, whoops. wrong one. Celtic knot. Probably. Hmm. This looks different than what we faced before. Now we're also dealing with rune symbols. Yes, I know. And then Tetris piece, swirly face. Wingardium Leviosa. You are head and shoulders above these bones. Nicely done. Rebellion. These are the worst puns ever. I see why Slytherin's student was so entranced with this place. Like. So, I kind of love it too. Bring them. Descend them. Bring them. Places. Bring them. Bring them. Bring them. Bring them. 
For a moment there, I thought that'd never end. Rebellion. Hmm, I'll use all my choppy cabbages on this. Good for you. Rebellion. Probably really shouldn't have done that. Accio. Dead end. Lovely. All that for nothing. Rebellion. Hold on. Don't give up yet. Oh no. Three dead people on a pyramid. The dark sacrifice involved to realize its intent may be great. <gasps> Sebastian! The relic! Look! But no, man. Could it be? The note and rendition of the relic. It matches. This must be where the student left the relic. I can't believe it. After all this, it lines up. We've really found it. What do you suppose is meant by the dark sacrifice required to realize the relic's potential? I have no idea, but we're here for the relic. Yeah, but... The note advises to leave the relic alone. I assure you, we were meant to find this. For Anne's sake, Man, you're I'm taking it. Yourself. Let's get to Feldcroft. You're gonna end up sacrificing I must keep yourself, this relic man. secret, especially from my uncle. Dude. Yeah, we've got a problem here. Is that ominous? Yeah, I told him ominous. to leave it. The sounds we kept hearing, it was you. You gave me no choice. I had to follow you. Sebastian, please, leave the relic alone. We can find another way to help Anne. Yeah. I'm sorry, Ominous, but I'm taking it. No, you're not. If you won't put it back, then I will. Hold on, both of you. Sebastian, please, take a step back. Fine, but Ominous knows I won't step back from a fight. Can't believe this. How much did you hear? Everything. I was glad to hear you tell Sebastian to leave the relic. Yeah. We need to stand together. Convince Sebastian this is wrong. And if nothing will change his mind? Something has to. I need your help. You're right. This seems far riskier than Sebastian realizes. Good. Yeah. We're agreed. We don't allow him to leave here with the relic. I do think we should talk to him, but I fear we won't stop him from taking the relic. What are you suggesting? I'm suggesting we negotiate. We allow Sebastian to leave with the relic under one condition. After this, no more. I feel that's what we agreed to in the scriptorium. I'm being taken for a fool. You're not, Ominous. This may be the only way to keep your friendship intact. Let's trust him to know what's best. Fine. If I trust him on this, I'm trusting you too. The dark arts seem harmless until it's too late. It's true. <sighs> Go then. Leave with the relic. I'll not say a word more. I hope I don't regret this. Sebastian, we're ready. Yeah. What is it? I haven't changed my mind. Ominous has. Let's go. What? Ominous? I'll explain on the way. Come on. Come on. This is it, man. I am not siding with you again. I am... Worry you. Well, what happened back there? Ominous and I found a compromise. Ominous simply needs a moment with you to change his mind. Is that it? I told him we ought to give you this chance. That the relic is too important to ignore. There has to be more to it than that. Tell me. We agreed on what was needed, Sebastian. You have my word. Yeah. I feel like this. I never wanted to keep all this from Ominous. He just doesn't understand. And I did want to worry him all over again. I know. But you, you got a problem here, buddy.
Oh, what have we done? I don't think we should have learned these curses. Just ignore this leaving, whole quest. Luminous wouldn't even acknowledge me. That's not like him. He was troubled, Sebastian. Even though we agreed to it all, it's been a lot to take in. I thought he understood. He knew we couldn't give up. All of this is too important for Anne. All right, we'll go to Feldcroft. Currently unavailable. Why? We have to run? For real? Why we gotta run there? And stones are in... Oh no, Feldcroft is in flames! This is no bueno. When we get to Feldcroft, I'd rather Anne not know what had to be done to get this relic. She thinks like ominous. It did only upset her. This is why we can't fast travel. Oh no, this isn't good. What is it? Smoke, over there, by the hamlet. Feldcroft's in trouble. They're under attack. Let's hurry. Let's see if we can pick off a couple by sneaking in. You can't stop. Oh, we we're gonna use mandrakes if we want. Why don't you come up here and fight me? Run, run, William! Go back! Keep out of the way! There's nowhere to go. One up there was nailing me. Unforgivable curse. From that damned book, no doubt. Your father would be ashamed. You've gone too far, Sebastian. Stay away from her. From all of us. Yeah. What did my uncle expect me to do? The Imperious Curse saved Anne's life. That goblin was going to kill her. There was little time to react. But it was an unforgivable curse. I acted in the moment. That's all. The problem. I shall make my uncle see reason. He cannot banish me from my own home. 
from my sister. It might be best to let him calm down a while. May I speak to him? Perhaps I can help to ease the tension a bit. You know, that's You may be right. Do. Very well. Probably best if I get away from here for a while. I'll head back to Hogwarts. Oh. Um. But you got him, Leviosa. No. Repair him. Sorry about that. Oh, my gear slots are full. Is there a vendor? Yes, there is a vendor. Hey, uh. But he's not here! What was he thinking? Pardon me, Mr. Sallow. What Sebastian did was inexcusable. You cannot possibly be about to defend him. Well, not really. Sebastian acted rashly, but he acted out of instinct to save Anne. Out of instinct? With an unforgivable curse? This family does not resort to using dark magic, even against our enemies. What Sebastian did cannot be undone. That you are defending Sebastian's behavior at all tells me everything I need to know. You are as guilty Man. as he is. Sebastian is to come nowhere near Feldcroft, nowhere near Anne. Unforgivable curses are so named for a reason. Oh, if true. I hear that either of you continues down this path, if either of you uses dark magic, I will notify the headmaster immediately. Yo, oh, crap. Just Why, a... Sebastian? Yeah. Yeah. It's like a <laughs> It's not like a storybook. Alright, so we need to go to uh Room of Requirement. We have to identify all our gear, upgrade, and then go sell everything. Bunch of stuff. All right, what are we gonna bring? So, uh, let's brew some more Thunder Brew. Pick up everything. Mandrake. Focus potion. Moonstone going. I need to need to see what we've got in here. Oh, like your fur, man. Uh, we need to brush them. Still eating. No. No. Why am I interacting with that? It was very difficult. All right. Oh, uh, so 
It can hold four active species. Okay. Um, so I could throw another moon calf in here. Throw another Niffler in here. Um, the Irondale Pilferer. Nice. Oh, we could we could um, breed moon calves. some moon caps. Uh, I don't think we can... There we go. Yeah. Okay. Now let's go to the beach. We got hippogriffs here. got two species, so we can throw the Neasles in here, and the Deary Calls. Get them all going here. The Hippogriff Feathers. Not what right it... now. Sorry, man. I did not mean to. I meant to feed you with this. Okay, you guys can do that. You guys are eating. Oat warts. Okay, you guys are doing great. You guys are having fun, all right. Oh, we could breed, we could breed measles too. Read a hippogriff. Yes. We're going to do hippogriffs first. All right. You should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. Okay. up those, but I am. Okay, we were going to upgrade our gear. Let's find the bestest of the best. Okay, that's... We're wearing best there. 76. You're so changing now. I'm so done with that. 91. That's amazing. Upgrade. Uh, upgrade. I have no whoopers. Oh, 
I can do Rap horn? I don't know what that is. Try the hat. Gobernal. Niffler toad works. Nice. Okay. The gloves, I don't know if they're worth upgrading. I need to find floopers. Goblin resistance one. So, since it's already there, we'll just increase that. So, what do we got for the hat? First targets. I don't think so. I think I want to do concentration all. Oh, I definitely need more deer calls. Petrificus Totalis? That's pretty cool. Oh. Deafening. You should be proud of all the potions. Too powerful for this item. Oh, interesting. Trait slot level two. Oh, okay. Okay. So, um, let's just... We've got a couple of Deary Calls. Alright, let's go to our map. Go to Hogsmeade. And let's go sell and see if there's anything we need to buy. I guess I should have checked that before I, I left. Cozy than Hogsmeade. Uh, I went the wrong way completely. <sighs> Ah. Oh, about that. Excuse me, coming through. I think I need to talk to somebody here. I was wondering when I'd see you again. All right, well. Two hundred gold for some of this stuff. that. Finding legendaries is awesome. So I could buy potting table with five small pots? I mean... Nothing like finding just the right thing, is there? Two large pots? Why not? I'm just gonna buy everything. Probably not worth it, but let me know if there's anything else I can do to help. It's what I've done. Uh, there is somebody here we need to talk to. It's Taki to Poppy. Hey, Poppy. Not the same Poppy. Yeah, we'll wait for it. It's not like her to forget. Hold on. 
should look like a mask. Sunglasses. Oh, we could look like Bane. Hogwarts regalia. Zonko's chief prankster. I don't know, man. Nickler? Harry Potter. I'm really not a fan of. Let me go with no. Okay, now the hat. Actually, this hat is kind of cool. But we could go with our top hat. <laughs> Oh, this dark sun hat. Leather sorcerer hat is kind of fun. We're wearing a hot top hat though. We could go with Zonko. Yeah, let's go with Zonko. Right now we're dressed pretty fine and we're we're okay. Cross Swan's champion. No. I think Protector was was pretty good. I think Protector is fine. And then the cloak. So many different. Fighter Slayer arm. Uh, no. Pompous. Well, that one's pretty good looking. What's this? Dark Arts? Ah, of course. Ooh, Dragon Hide is pretty cool. Let's go with Dragon Hide. And let's change our neck. Oh, no. Yeah, no scarf. Although it's wintertime, so maybe we should be wearing a scarf. Just do it. Ancient Mysteries. That's cool. Alright, it is wintertime. So. Alright, now we're looking good, Poppy. Now we can. I didn't keep you waiting, did I? Not at all. I was just at the post office. Gran told me to expect a package, but it looks as if she forgot to send it. She didn't send me an owl this week either. Perhaps she's busy with her research. That's not good. What kind of research is she doing? It varies from week to week, but it's always to do with creatures. Last week she was studying leg knots in Plimpies. See. What was she sending you? Only some feed she's been developing. I was going to give it to Professor Howen for the measles. What did you find out about the dragon you were tracking? I realized that she didn't know the poachers had her egg, so when she left Horntail Hall, she would have headed straight to her nest. I went back to the tent and tracked her flight. How do you track a dragon long after she's gone? Tree canopies, burn marks, things like that. Oh! Well done. You certainly know what you're doing. I can't be certain, but I have an idea of one place she may have been heading. I thought we might go and see it for ourselves. Of course. Shall we leave now? If that's all right, I want to see how she's faring if she had a collar on. And she's likely frantic about her egg. Here we are. I do think this is where we'll find her. 
The terrain's typical of where the breed would nest. I suspect it's how the poachers found her to begin with. They likely camped here and logged her patterns. Ah. Perhaps nabbed her first and then her egg. Dragons are hard enough to wrangle, let alone maternal ones. You got all of that from simply standing here? You'd be surprised how easy it is to think like a poacher. Shall we see if she's home? We only need to return her egg. That sounds straightforward enough. We should be in and out. Then we can be finished with the poachers once and for all. If you're right about finding her here, how do we go about returning the egg? Her nest will likely be in the heart of her den, which she will be keeping guard over. It might also be more charred than anywhere else, I imagine. Uh, why not keep the egg? I don't suppose you've thought about keeping it, have you? No, it belongs to her. Keeping it will make me just as bad as the poachers. Fair point. Well then, let's find our dragon and return her egg. Wonderful. If she sees us flying about, she might take it as a sign of aggression or food. We should stay on foot. Oh, and one more thing. Let's not agitate her. Goodness knows she's been through enough already. I'm ready when you are. Revelio. There she is, above us. She did make it home safe. Oh, good. It looks as if she wasn't collared like the other dragons. Oh, man, if I help myself, this means. Hey, um... I have something... Poor thing must be worried sick, wondering what happened to her egg. Yeah. Sure. Revelio. Worried sick. For what it's worth, she doesn't seem to have spotted us yet. Let's hope it stays that way. At least until we've done what we came to do. Confringo. Places. She's gonna be Sorry. I wonder how many they brought to capture her. At least ten usually. Revenue. Oh, this is their camp. There she is again. She's breathtaking. <laughs> From a distance. Fantastic. Fantastic piece and where to find it. Not the bridge I broke pre <coughs> previously. No, no, different. Different location. Hmm, I wonder how good her eyesight is. I beg your pardon. I don't imagine the poachers fed her well. And from a distance, we probably look exactly like sheep to her. Hebrideans love sheep. How lucky for us. Yeah. Like Revelio. Oh, excuse me while I... Watch your step. <coughs> run and sneak. Just raring for a fight. Loot, 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 loot. Revelio. Loot, loot, loot. Quiet, loot. what was that? Oh no. I was hiding. Over here! Wait here! 
I'll draw her attention. Follow when it's safe. Revenue. She listened to reason. I'd normally try, but we're well past that. Why is every repair uh, she broke them all? Run now. If we just return her egg, we can hopefully make it out without too much fuss. Run. recognizes they were in the tent. Stupid <laughs> kids. Playing with dragons. That was brilliant. And did you see how clever? She left us perfectly unharmed. <sighs> Creatures are a lot cleverer than most people realize. That's true. That's what Gran always says. The important thing is that we survived it. And we returned her egg. Thank you for doing this with me. Wouldn't blame you one bit if you wanted to head back to the castle and never think about dragons again. Shall we head back? I'm ready if you I are. Looted I am. Up. After our dragon rescue at Hauntel Hall, I half expect to be ambushed by poachers any time I'm not in the castle. Understandable. We did sabotage their fighting ring and steal a dragon egg from them. True, true. So why haven't they come after us? It's not like them to let things lie. Unless... Unless what? Unless they haven't let things lie. Oh no, I can't believe I didn't see it. We need to leave. I need to send an owl. It was Gran. Gran's in trouble. That's why Gran didn't send anything. How could I have been so blind? Nice. Alright, let's see if there's anything at Beast's place that we can find. Hogsmeade, here I come. Come in! Sorry if there's a smell. New batch of toad hide. Let's sell. 
Oh, that's right. She won't buy anything. Oh, <coughs> we could buy whooper feathers. You could never go wrong with those. And get Good a choice, horn. I'd say. A unicorn hair. We've got everything else. I can take a deer call feather too. You could never go wrong with those. Good choice, I'd say. You guys are awesome. And let's go up to the other. The other. Potions place or this place, whatever this is. Dogweed, yeah. The other plants place. Have a look around. I'll be with you in just a minute. Need to go loot. Doors always open. You be sure to stop by soon. Nothing to buy there. All right. I know there was something I. Look at that. There's, there's Hogwarts. That's cool. All right. Let's see what's next on our quest list. Oh. Let's talk to him. Oh, I was playing Any offline. Indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. And I completed something. You miserable lamb. Your sister has been slipmongered for three days, and she's still vomiting slugs. If you ever point your wand at your family again, mark my words, you will lose that wand. <laughs> <laughs> she got a howler. I love it. So I finally collected all of the house tokens and I need to figure out what that all leads to. So. Did you speak with my uncle? I wish I had better news about your uncle and Anne. Well, what did he say? I'm afraid he wants you nowhere near Feldcroft. Nor Anne. I had to stop that goblin from killing my sister. He had no right to banish me from my own twin. Mm. If he thinks banishing me means I'm going to give up on Anne, he's sorely mistaken. He also said he cannot excuse the use of dark magic in any form, and that if he hears of either of us using it, he'll go straight to Professor Black. Huh? That relic, dark magic or not, is the key to saving Anne, to reverse that curse. I will not lose Anne for good. I should send the crest to Anne. She'll know that we need to meet. I'm afraid I don't follow. Nothing, just a thought. Now I'm more determined than ever to learn what power that relic has. What did you mean you'd send Anne a crest so that she'd know to meet you? It's... we just lost our parents and we were packing up to go and live with Solomon. We couldn't take everything. She was carefully organizing her prized possessions. A box of artifacts she'd collected to do with our family. Jewelry, cards, old photographs. She got to her favorite, a handmade crest. And without a second thought, she handed it to me. This will keep you safe, she said. It holds no enchantment, but I've kept it with me since. That's how I can reach Anne. I'll get the crest to her with plans to meet. Be careful, Sebastian. Your uncle could intercept it. We'll be expelled. Even if Ominous is upset with us, he has no love lost for his family. He'd use their hmm. connections to the headmaster if we needed his help. I shall wait to hear from you then. Thank you. I very much appreciate you standing by me through all of this. Mm. Why my neck hurts? I'll send you an owl when I have news. I was working on the basement earlier. <sighs> all right. Next quest. Uh. Oh, 
potions to the nation. Let's see if we can find um gobstone. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Yeah, see. Revelio. There's one right there. So frustrating. Ugh. You wanted to speak with me, Mother? I had hoped to speak with you alone, Natsai. Your message mentioned your concern about an unusual creature that was spotted in the woods near Hogsmeade. That could have been anything. You know what it was, Natsai. I am allowed to leave the castle. I am always careful, Mother. Careful? Officer Singer disagrees. She sent me an owl telling me that you have been trying to collect evidence of some kind against dark wizards. She berated me for not keeping a closer eye on you. And she is right. I do not want you visiting Hogsmeade for the near future. But Mother! My little gazelle, you are well-intentioned, but you must not meddle in the affairs of dangerous people. True. If someone had meddled in Matabilaland, Father would still be with us. Wow. I must get to class. Perhaps your friend can get you to listen to reason. Wow. Wow. So frustrating. She never listens to me. She called you her little gazelle. Is that a term of endearment where you're from? It is specific Ooh, to me. <sighs> I am the unusual creature in Hogsmeade she mentioned. Self-transfiguration is not taught at Hogwarts, so I am gently discouraged from practicing it. However, I am an Animagus. What? And it is in my gazelle form that I have been able to wander the Highlands rather freely until now. Much to my mother's chagrin. That is She's how I managed to spy on Rookwood and Harlow. Were you born an Animagus, or did you learn to become one? Animagi are not born. The process is quite elaborate. It involves holding a mandrake leaf in one's mouth for an entire month. What? Then placing the leaf in a crystal file so that it is imbued with moonlight. Then adding one of your own hairs. And that is just the beginning. Self-transfiguration is common among students at Wagadu. But Professor <laughs> Weasley considers it much too dangerous to teach at Hogwarts. Wow. Can you choose what form your animagus will take? Oh, no. A person's animagus form is determined by their personality. My mother is convinced that my form is a gazelle because I adapt well to any situation. Wow. I believe it is because I can sense danger and keep my wits about me. How does it feel to transform into an animal? Well, the first time, it can be a bit unnerving. I felt a kind of searing pain and a strong double heartbeat. But it gets easier the more you do it. I no longer feel any pain, and I must say, I find a sense of comfort in the double heartbeat. And I love being able to view the world from a different perspective. That's crazy. Now the nickname makes sense. What an extraordinary ability to have. It is. That cat behind I him. love transforming, but Mother is less enthusiastic about She's it. She's gonna get stuck. She says that no creature especially one as rare as a gazelle, should be bounding about where poaching exactly. has become so prevalent. <sighs> she claims that she has foreseen tragedy befall me in my gazelle form. Well, I have but seen. she has used her sight to control me too many times. I no longer believe it. She's concerned for your safety. That may be safe, but I do not believe that it would be best. Do you? You could have fled the moment you discovered that Rookwood, Harlow, and Randrock were after you. But you did not. Yeah, but I, I got ancient act magic, you girl. Have. I must deal with Rookwood and Harlow, not hide from them. <sighs> My mother cannot know where I am all the time. Divine thing. Thank you for being here during that rather awkward conversation. Yeah. Oh, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. All right, let's go find Zenobia. 
Cheese. How nice to see you, my young friend. Outside some classrooms. I don't think it's these ones. I think she is near this this place. I think she's near Professor Fig. But we'll find out. Yeah, I think she's around here. Yeah, this is the general area she's in. Revelio. Over here. Here she is. Hello, Zenobia. What did you need help with? I need someone to collect my gobstones that have been. Uh, I've got them. Mm. Come on. Come on, game. Nothing. My... Okay. Okay. My computer. All right. Finally. That was dumb. All right. <clears throat> I have found all of her gobstones. Hello, Zenobia. I need it says six of six. So yeah, that one's broken. You can't imagine how we can... Unless there's one that I'm missing. Thing is, I've I've gathered all of these before. Keyboard's freaking out on me. How do we get up? I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Revelio!
My game. Akio. That's the last of Zenobia's gobstones. I should go and see her. It said I had six of six. I don't know, man. <laughs> That's weird. And it wasn't tracking Handy it before. Resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. I hope you've had more luck than I did tracking down. Hello, Zenobia. I found all your gobstones. Really? I didn't think it was possible. It was like my first How side quest ever. <laughs> Common sense and basic magic. Well, <clears throat> may I have my gobstones back? Yeah. Of course. They are yours, after all. Oh, how wonderful. I shall dedicate all my future victories to you. Speaking of which, now that I have all my gobstones back, I wonder if anyone in the common room would be up for a game. Uh... That's a horrible idea. No one wants to get that awful stench all over them again. Why not? Gobstones are splendid fun, and now everyone knows the rules. Sorry, Very kid. well, off I go. Wish me luck. Yeah, no. Well, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. Yeah, well. Alright, so that quest was like my first side quest ever, and I finally finished it off. Uh, let's talk to Poppy. Where'd she go? East classroom, maybe? Spiking? Oh, good, you're safe. Yeah, I'm fine. There you are. You were in such a state when you left. The poachers got to my gran. Someone recognized me in Horntail Hall and... They got to her. What do you mean? Is she all right? She's fine, thank goodness. But they were at her house. Our house. They assumed I'd sent the egg there. She said they took the whole place apart looking for it, screaming that we cost them everything. Oh, wow. I'm sorry, Poppy. I'm glad she's all right. I don't think either one of us could have anticipated that. I should have known. I underestimated the poachers. Oh, we and now another creature's in danger. Oh, what no. do you mean? The poachers refused to leave empty-handed, so they took valuable journals that Gran had discovered when she was researching rare creatures. One of them contained theories about a secret hiding place of the Snidget, long thought to be extinct. Exactly what kind of creature is a Snidget? It's a small bird with golden feathers. It's incredible. It has rotational wings that allow it to dart quickly in any direction. In fact, the golden snitch in Quidditch is based on the Snidget, which barbarically was actually used in the sport hundreds of years ago. Wow. Why would Snidgets be valuable to poachers? They could make more money with Snidgets than they ever would have fighting dragons. The golden Snidget's feathers and eyes are incredibly valuable. That's why they're believed to be extinct. Aww. They the were hunted eyes? out of existence by wizard kind. If the poachers found some now, I can't bear to think about the horrific way they'd be bred and killed for profit. Where exactly are these snidgets allegedly hidden? Gran says the journals were a bit cryptic, which is good. Perhaps the poachers won't be clever enough to find the birds. From what she recalls, the journals only noted that the key to finding them lay in the moonlight. Gran thinks it can be narrowed down to a handful of locations. I take it you aren't going to let the poachers anywhere near the Snidgets? Gran wants me to stay out of it. But I know she's devastated that poachers might go after the Snidgets, if they still exist. We had the element of surprise on our side when we saved that dragon. But the poachers will be watching for us now. 
We need allies. Others who hate the poachers enough to help us, who value creatures as much Merlin's as... Merlin's beard! You're genius! The centaurs! They'd want the Snidgets protected at all costs. Sounds as if we need to go and talk to the centaurs. We'll need to be careful in how we approach them. Tensions with them are high. Still, I think they may be our only hope. Let me think on it. I'll let you know as soon as I have a plan. All right, cool. So, oh, gobbledygook. See. Okay, we're gonna do this one. I don't know if it's gonna work. We're going to save before we do this because I tried to do it off stream. I didn't seem to be getting any results. So maybe now that I've restarted the game. Packard. No, Weasley. Oh. All right, let's save. All right. I'd die of embarrassment if my mother taught at Hogwarts. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Okay. Here we go, the last house token. Time to see what's inside. Rebellion. Well, look at that. Thanks goes to the former headmistress, Eupraxia Mole. Huh. Speak with Nelly. Okay, it worked this time. Okay, last time it didn't work, so this is great. I'm excited. Finally tracked down all of those chests. Um, yeah. What yeah. are you up to now? Were you able to follow one of the Dedalian keys? Hello, Nelly. Actually, I found all of the keys and opened my house chest. Oh, wonderful. What did you find? I found a rather interesting costume. Brilliant. Whew. Well, thank you for solving that mystery for me. I always wondered what those keys would lead to. Nice. That was like my second side quest that I ever picked up in the game. <laughs> Hold on a second. Um, so that one's done. Um, let's look at challenges. Islands. Hogs. Oh, ancient magic one? Beasts. Okay. Gotta go to an astronomy table. Infamous foes. Ooh, 70 spiders. Okay. Well, we keep going. Let's look at our talents. I have one talent point available. Uh, turn them into explosive objects. That's interesting. 
That's really interesting. Huh. Hmm. We'll think on that. Not getting talent points very often anymore. Alright. <coughs> Got a lot of our moons collected. Alright. Let's go talk to Sebastian. Oh, uh, maybe we wait till night? There's a astronomy table up there. How nice to see you, my young friend. Oh, oops. Hmm. Seems a pleasant enough little place. Nighttime. I thought my owl might pique your interest. Okay, it's nighttime. We're gonna go back. I should dismount here. Revelio. Wonder who lives here. We're just gonna get this table real quick. An astronomy table should prove useful once the sun's down. What? The sun is down. I came as soon as I could. I'd been so preoccupied by all that happened with Ominous and the catacomb, not to mention my uncle's reaction, that I'd almost forgotten what it was that struck me about that triptych. This is the view painted on the canvas that was left on it. That's incredible. You know this area well. And while I was waiting for you, I scouted around and discovered an abandoned mine nearby, surrounded by Ranlock's loyalists. Sneaky. Do you think there's a connection to the triptych? I've no idea, but perhaps they're searching it. The way they did Rookwood Castle and Isadora's Manor. How do we want to handle this? Oh, I see. We need to see what they're doing, but let's not draw their attention. Very well. And I still have that rune symbol we found on the triptych. If there is a connection, I suspect we'll see that symbol again. Yeah, yeah. After you. Silent as a grave. <laughs> Oh, yeah, we're doing this. There they are up ahead. I'll let you lead. No one enters this mine. Kill anyone who tries. All of Ranrock's loyalists deserve the same fate. Nice work, Revelio. <laughs> I'm like, this is gonna be close. But then I got it. It's funny that this is not an unforgivable curse. I use it all the time. This is going well. We make a good team. We do at that. Listen. 
I don't mind working with Slytherin. Once again, we could fight our way through or be but discreet. You know which one I'd choose. Well, of course, but not me. Well, this might be the best meal I've had in years. No, I mean it. I don't think I should need to eat again. <laughs> There's no tell us. What was that? If you don't fill up so much, you can actually go further. It's true. Eat a big meal, you'll be slow. The trick is to tell us. Why is it? How nice it is to stop. How? Yeah. Enough of that. Good for you. I'll get away with that. Fun is a relative term. <laughs> it is. Rebellion. And that was relatively fun. <laughs> okay. That was pretty good. <laughs> Rebellion. This mine was closed long ago due to an infestation of spiders. Well, How nice. Spiders are kind of the thing that we fight, so let's do it, buddy. Revelio. For better or for worse, we're in. You haven't had mushrooms. <laughs> Mine looks like a tomb. It was closed after accidents were reported. Revelio. Now I see why. Confringo. It's down. Okay. We're going up to go down. I don't uh, see any goblins in these webs. Too disgusting for even a spider to prey on. Think there's something here they want. Revelio. There's a chest here somewhere. Above or below. Confirm. That leg is awfully high. Confirm. Any ideas? Revelio. Yeah, I know. I don't want to go that way yet. I want to loot. Fine. Wingardium uh. Leviosa. No wonder spiders give people goosebumps. Could be the hairy legs, or the solar size, or the venomous fangs, <laughs> or any number of endearing qualities, really. Smashing. Should have thought to conjure stairs. Revelio. I 
almost like a one-way thing here. That bridge has seen better days. Rid the world of another spider. I shall sleep better tonight. Silent as a... We're making quick work of them. Revelio. Professor Hecate would be proud. She would at that. Ramrock's loyalists have all but declared war. Lumos. Confringo, please. Bombarda. Lumos. Revelio. Spiders everywhere, man. We've still not seen a single rune symbol. I think we're going to be a bit distracted from runes for a moment. An unwelcome distraction at that. We have another fight on our hands. Why am I not surprised? I was only following orders. Leave your accusations in someone else's direction if you don't mind.
Certainly cleared the room. You're not a bad chap for a Slytherin. For a Ravenclaw, you certainly have a lot to do. <laughs> Revelio. Can bring up. Symbol above the cavern door. Ranrock's loyalists never knew to look for it. Oh, there it is. Okay. Wasn't expecting that. Okay, there we go. Revelio. We're going juice. <laughs> Well, we shouldn't find loyalists in here. They they didn't open it, right? Will floated back to me as if in a watery haze. How long have I been unconscious? I only remember his eyes empty. Empty of sorrow, yes, but also I recall a feeling of the euphoria as I watched the pain vanish. Then everything started to turn. When I fell, I must have hit my head. I neither feel nor see a mark, but the pain is throbbing. I can hope it's not the black. <gasps> oh, no. What do you have there? A journal entry by Isadora. Oh, Sebastian, I think I found something. A canvas piece. Brilliant. Our efforts weren't in vain after all. Still, something about this place feels odd. Revelio. Yeah. Just a minute. Oh, that's beyond there. Okay. If the triptych led us here to find this bit of canvas, we can probably assume that Isadora Morganark was here. Yeah. She seems to have been everywhere. But if she was using the Undercroft and the cellar beneath her manor in Feldcroft, why would she create this space? And why hide it behind cryptic rune symbols? This was an ancient magic that no one but you after could see. She could, after Isadora she and Percival Rackham, another of the keepers, could see traces of ancient magic too. Rackham? I haven't heard his name before. Here's are some of the memories I've seen. I don't think he and Isadora saw eye to eye on how this magic should be used. Yeah. This is all rather baffling. Let's take the canvas back to the triptych. Perhaps the answers are there. Okay. This place is odd, to be sure. But I'm fascinated by it. Now, for the trek back out of here and to Hogwarts. Unless we can... Yeah. Now for the moment of truth. It has to fit. Please tell me you recognize the location in this bit of canvas. The good news is I do, in fact. And the bad news? We're in for more trouble. <laughs> of course. I know that coast. Ranrock has taken over a huge mine in the surrounding area. Marenween has suffered for it. It's as bad as Feldcroft's become. Should we head there now? We should wait. Why? All this time, we've been a step behind Ranrock. I may know someone who could help us get ahead. Who is that? <sighs> someone who knows Ranrock personally. 
They asked me not to mention their name to anyone. A goblin? Tell me I'm wrong. You know goblins cursed my sister to shut her up. Said she should be seen and not heard. I do, but not all goblins Not are... all goblins what? Have you forgotten, Feldcroft? Have you forgotten the mine we just went through? No, no Sebastian, I haven't. You're not listening to me. Why would I listen to someone so ignorant? You don't know what you're saying. Take a breath for a moment. Oh, I know precisely what I'm saying. Man. Unbelievable. Dude. Racist. Jerk it, Heinrich. Good for you. I think we're going to call it a night there. Thanks for watching. Dealing with this jerk. Y'all have a great night wherever you're at. Catch you later. Outro. That's it. I got you and your vibes in my mind. I can get them out. No matter how hard I try. I need you and your heart next to mine Yeah, I'm all about keeping it you and I When you're here, you spark chemical reactions Your aura strikes like lightning Got no words, I'm just drowning in attraction Only one way to describe it Double.